journal components broadly speaking i would say there are three journal components one is a journal batch a journal batch basically helps you to combine several journals in one batch okay one can optionally specify a control total at a journal batch level to control the total of all the journals that are lying within a batch all right now at this point of time let me do one thing let me go into oracle applications so that you can understand a little more better okay so here am i in oracle application i'll just log in as with some existing user all right hold on so I'll use a user all right i will just show you a couple of journals that have been creating it for testing purposes so you just understand the hang of uh, the journal entry form but of course later we'll be using this form quite often in our course so you'll, you'll get pretty much used to this form all right so let me just query a journal all right so as you could see there is one batch that's been defined out there so as you could see there is one batch uh, this batch name there is a batch name you can give it's called as a test bat 02 and then it's listed down the total of uh, the journal debit and credit amount within that batch okay so let me just open this this uh, <coughs> uh, this batch I say review batch so while I was making the batch look I I can give the batch name the period in which the batch is created and finally I can give a control total so as I explained you earlier a control total basically make sure that the total of journal uh, amount or all journal amounts within a batch doesn't exceed now that was the batch wherein I can give the different details out there and I, ca I can also specify the balance type whether it's actual or budget or a journal type out here it's a standard journal average journal finally I go in and define the journals so I click on these journals and that's where I go and define journals so this part on the top is what you call as the journal header okay so the journal header can okay, can contain a, a journal header name and you can optionally give a description you can specify the currency in which uh, the journal you are making you can also choose a foreign currency but in that case you must have a rate defined between your foreign currency and your functional currency okay <coughs> then finally uh, you can give uh, the category of that journal what kind of a journal it is whether it's a manual journal or it's an adjustment journal or it's a recurring journal or what kind of a journal it is like a category okay rest of all uh, the fields gets defaulted automatically so that's basically the journal header part okay now when you come out to the detail part uh, one header can contain any number of lines within within it okay but the line uh, total of debit must equal the total of credit okay this is something I was explaining you as a part of financial accounting we were wherein you know we were entering the journals or I've shown you the journals in the Excel spreadsheet if you recall so this is the same way this is just an automated way of doing it in a system wherein everything is saved in the system and the system performs all the validation checks okay so as you could see out here you can indicate the account which account it is you can uh, give the amount and if it's a foreign currency journal then based on uh, your rate defined Oracle automatically converts it to your functional currency and then you can optionally specify a description okay and once you are and once you've entered uh, your uh, you know debits and credit lines then you can save the journal and as a next step you post that journal to the ledger so I have already posted this journal so as you could see the posted uh, the button is now disabled because it's already posted but uh, there are a number of features that you can use it in this form for example you know if you want to reverse this journal before posting you can always do it and similarly you can uh, look at the T accounts for this journal just like what I've shown you so all this we will uh, do it as a part of uh, 
a discourse i i'm going to come back to this form uh, in the next coming movies but uh, well those are basically the three major components as far as your journals are concerned